Okay, now that I own the Mach Megazord, I can now create the Skyrev Megazord formation. So, starting with Falcon Zord, uh, remove the tailpiece and set it aside. Close the propellers up and tap them shut. On the bottom, there's this clip. Take it out, pull it back, snap. And you are done with Falcon Zord. Okay, with the Tiger Jet, uh, just take this piece out and set it aside. And there's a tab down here too. Take it out and snap it shut. And that's it for the Tiger Jet. Alright, the Whale Zord is definitely more complex to transform than the other two. Start with him. Uh, take the head out. Flip it upside down. Click it back in. Turn it up this way. Fold down the wings. Flip these up. And remove the cargo pieces. Set them aside. Uh, unsnap the tail. Move it out slightly. Turn it facing forward. Turn these forward. Uh, these two tabs here, turn them up. This one piece here, pull it out all the way. Then push it down. And that's it for the whale zord. Alright, with the Zenith formation, remove the helmet and the shoot on the back entirely. Okay. Fold down the wings and extend the arms out to the side, like so. Now that's about it for Zenith. Alright, for all the little random pieces that came off of Falcon and Tiger and Whale, uh, turn this guy around. Uh, these two pieces are going to connect to the bottom of his foot behind it. Again, you just have to feel around until they fit. Shouldn't be too hard. Uh, all right. um, Falcon's tail. Extend this if you want. I do it. You don't have to. Place it on the top. All right. Close it up. Um, this will be the new helmet. Flip these up. Inside. Flip the mask down. Stick it on his head. All right. Okay, now with Falcon and Tiger, um, there's these little slots inside the shoulder. It's hard to see with the camera, but they're, they're there. Uh, these two are gonna snap into them, like so. It's a bit hard to, but you'll get it. There you go. This guy as well. Now the whale zord, if you want to do um, with the, um, the zenith head, you can either close it up and put it back underneath the um, crocodile carrier, or as in the instructions, let's see, there's this little tab under here, this little opening. Now you take the top part, rotate it, and stick it in there. So until it holds in by on its own, like so. Uh, turn around. Uh, this tab in the back of a um, line hauler, and there's two little, again, two little hidden slots here. Uh, these three pieces are going to connect to, like so. And here you have Skyrev Megazord. Uh, one more thing, um, with the V-Shield, uh, with this piece attached, there's a hole in the back of here. You just tab it in, and just let it hang there, and that should be it. So, yeah, here's Skyrev for you. Definitely a lot more bulkier and heavier with the Whale Zord on its back. Uh, these guys are still loose. But I read a tip that, hang on, if you take a rubber band that these guys are packaged with, or any rubber bands the size, 
wrap it around the peg and it makes it a tighter fit which solves that problem. Now articulation for the arms is greatly limited by the whale. It is prone to fall off anytime you try to do it so be worn. Tiger Jet's slightly easier because it's skinnier. Still comes off. Falcon Zord you can't really do it at all because the Zord is blocked by the wing. So if you want to adjust this part, untap it, crank it all the way there, and snap it in. Again, be careful, the whale can fall off anytime. Though, just standing alone, it holds well. So yeah, that's the Skyrath Megazord for you. Uh, thanks for watching this, and have a good day.